That's right. Some other days a week. Meeting to order, please. Please join me in a salute to the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which stands one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <coughs> Madam Secretary, roll call, please. Here. Here. Ms. Thompson? Here. Mayor Chow? Here. Mr. Rossi? Here. Ms. Doherty? Here. Six present. First of all, I want to welcome um, all friends and family to this chamber tonight. Very, very excited, a uh, very special day for everyone here. Um, I will now move down to the next item on the uh, agenda. Three, special order of business. I need a motion to appoint Susie Chun to fill the open seat on the Law School Committee. So by moved. Ms. LaRoss, second by, who we'll moved that? Me. <laughs> Moved by Ms. Thompson, second by Ms. Mon. Madam Secretary, roll call, please. Uh, moved by Ms. Thompson, second by Ms. Mon. Mr. Lay? Yes. Ms. Mon? Yes. Ms. Thompson? Yes. Yes. Ms. Del Rossi? Yes. Ms. Doherty? Yes. Six days approved. I now ask Ms. Chun, please come forward and have Judge Gary administer the oath of the office. Your Honor. Okay. Okay, good evening, everyone. My name is Steve Geary. I'm one of the judges in the Lowell District Court here. I'm also from the city of Lowell, and I'm actually a, in your district. So I have the distinct honor and pleasure of administering uh, this official oath tonight. So please uh, read after me, ma'am. Raise your right hand. I do, do solemnly swear and affirm that I will faithfully and impartially discharge and perform all of the duties Incumbent on me as a member of the Lowell School Committee. Incumbent on me as member of the Lowell School Committee members. According to the best of my ability and understanding. According to the best of my ability and understanding. Agreeably to the rules and regulations of the Constitution. Agreeably to the rules and regulations of the Constitution. In laws of this Commonwealth. And the laws of this Commonwealth. In ordinance, in ordinances of the City of Lowell. So help me God. So help me God. Mary, I'll see you. Yeah. Goodbye. <laughs> Mr. Mayor, may I have one comment? Mr. Lay. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Uh, welcome, Susie. And uh, I just I'm impressed how much uh, how much crowd you can bring for tonight. And uh, I hope that um, I hope that everybody here now can come and uh, attend school committee. Uh, uh, so I invite everybody to uh, to come to the school committee and and maybe if you can stay late today and. Uh, Stay with us for the rest of the school committee meeting at 6.30 to 
Maybe 6.30 to maybe 8. <laughs> Ms. Thompson. Thank you. I think, first of all, I want to say, Susie, welcome. It would be remiss of me not to say that there are now two women of color serving on the school committee in the first time in history. <laughs> and I am honored to serve with you, Susie. I look forward to many, many conversations. Would you like to say anything? <laughs> or uh, maybe have Mr. Rossi go first, Mr. Rossi. I just want to say Susie and I worked together years and years ago at the charter school in Lowell and she was one of the most amazing teachers and caregivers that I have ever had the pleasure of working with and I completely look forward to working with her again and I'm very excited because she's a passionate fiery young lady. <laughs> Thank you. Ms. Chun, go, go right ahead. Sure. Um, can I have my team members please come stand with me and my families, please? This is an honor. It's just going to take you guys a couple minutes. I'm sorry. The whole community. <laughs> um, I have families from Fitchburg. Drove all the way over here for tonight. <laughs> Good evening, Mr. Mayor, committee members, and attendees. I am humbled and honored to serve as a Lowell School Committee member. Mr. Dakota has brought a level of dedication and service to the families of Lowell both in the classroom and his eight years on the school committee. My family and I wish him well as he meets up upcoming ca challenges. Our campaign message was well received by so many low voters. Thank you to all who choose, chose me at the polls and to those who made a different choice. I look forward to earning your vote as you see my vision put into action. I also want to thank the members of our team who worked so hard on our campaign. I look forward to working together with my fellow committee members, school personnel, and Lowell families to ensure our children's future success. The city of Lowell is my adopted home. I was educated in Lowell's school system. My children both graduated from Lowell High School and I am excited to use the valuable experiences gained from working in the education system in Lowell for over 20 years. It has been my dream to be a part of the positive changes in our city. The Lowell Public School System strives to educate all its children. I bring a new vision to the table, hoping to maximize family engagement, engagement to strengthen the school experience for our children and solidify their path to the future. I pledge to work with the school administration to do what is the best interest of all parents and students. I am prepared to use my strength and resilience to do the work necessary to set our children on the path for success. Our children in low are counting on us, and I look forward to being part of the team that represents them. And this is the image of what low should look like, all of us together here tonight. Thank you very much for giving me the opportunity to speak and to serve. And also, I would like to thank the director of Lowell Community Charter Public School and our COO that are here tonight as well. Thank you. And IBW, thank you so much. Now did uh, motion to adjourn by Mr. Rossi, second by Mr. Lay. Motion is passed. Thank you. Sorry, Your Honor. Do we want to do a photo with the committee and the mayor that we can put on the website? 
We could just stand behind the desk. Shoes or so you're ready for it. Exactly. Then I'm making a photo though for <laughs> Billy Joe.